An inclusive and meaningful digital future is one where no one is left behind. Wondercraft, a robotics company developing a first-of-its-kind self-balancing personal exoskeleton, is enabling people who cannot walk the opportunity to stand up and walk again in their everyday lives. And you have actually may have already seen this during the Paris Olympics in 2024 with para-athlete Kevin Piet, who became the first person with paraplegia to work to walk the torch in the Summer Olympics relay. And today, you're gonna to see this very same prototype presented by Bianca Faith Johnson, JD. She is making her way there. You know what? We're gonna forget all the run-throughs because I just wanna get right through you. Uh, tell me, this is really a game changer. Talk to me about what happened to you. I know that you became paralyzed. Tell me about that journey. So seven years ago, I was in a near-fatal motorcycle accident, so no fault of my own. And as a result of that, I sustained a T4, T6 spinal cord injury. So um, that's the equivalent of me being paralyzed from about mid-chest down. And that completely changed your life. Absolutely. Can you tell me just how difficult that moment was in the journey after that? That moment was extremely difficult. Imagine waking up in the hospital and being probed by doctors asking, can you move your legs and not being able to. My entire world was literally shifted upside down. Um, but I knew that even in that moment, I was still gonna make it. And I needed to make sure that I prepared myself for what was to come, for technology such as this. Well, I can see your sunshine just radiating, and I can tell that you are a fighter and you are strong. So, so shall we walk through this together? Absolutely. Okay. So tell me about this technology. All of a sudden you found out about it, but how did you find out about it? So I'm actually the acting chair of an organization called Push to Walk, which is located in New Jersey. It's a spinal cord injury gym. And we were fortunate enough to have the opportunity for Wondercraft, an amazing organization who is the creators of this exoskeleton, to come and do some demos. And I was a part of that demonstration. And from there, the synergy was just perfect. And I've been working with them ever since. Okay, so let's, let's show everyone, shall we? Wow, wow, that's incredible. Shall we walk forward a little bit? Absolutely. Okay. Wow, wow, incredible. So this has changed everything because one thing I remember reading about you, you were saying like I was standing up talking to you and you were saying that before I had to look up, but now you're able to look Eye to eye. eye to eye. That means everything, right? Everything. Talk to me about that. This is how our bodies were intended to be. So, and then, of course, I was injured. So I remember what it felt like standing upright, walking upright, and looking someone and having that type of connection eye to eye. So now in this self-balancing prototype, this exoskeleton, I'm able to do so hands-free, mm -hmm. and I can talk to you just like everyone else would. And also just having the freedom to go where you want to go. I mean, did you ever imagine you would be here at the UN walking and talking to this incredible crowd? I did not imagine this exactly, but I knew it would be something like this. You knew it would be so <laughs> Shall we walk a little bit more forward? Let's do it. Okay, so as we do this, can you tell me about that first moment when you got in the exoskeleton and then being able to move like this? It was literally everything because imagine for seven years I've been in a seated position, um, unable to stand on my own or walk on my own. So the moment I was engulfed and put on this exoskeleton, it put me on. <laughs> and I was able to embody the position that my body was used to doing. It is almost like a little muscle memory thing going on, mm -hmm. you know? It remembers where I came from and it's bringing me into where I need to be. And it's bringing your spirit to life again. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Was there anything else you wanted to share with everyone? This technology is just absolutely amazing. Um, and I just want everyone to acknowledge that what you are looking at is literally the future in the present. Um, it has given back my, it has the potential to give me back my movement and with it, my freedom. 
Um, so I plan on just making sure that I'm maximizing on this opportunity. This should be a, a, a supported. You should be spreading the word, sending it to your friends, and letting everyone know that Wondercraft in particular, it's an organization that is for the people, for people like me, so that we can get our lives back. And it may not change the world, but it certainly has the potential to change mine. That's what technology is all about. That's what today is all about, giving access to people, changing their lives, yes. right? Yes, yes. And is somebody here from Wondercraft? I, I wish they were. I'm surrounded okay. by them. OK, well, <laughs> Wondercraft is here. Uh, yes? One right here. Oh, right, right here. here. Oh, wait, yeah. wait, wait, wait. I thought you were just helping along. Yes, yeah. So, So tell me just about what this means for you working on this. It is so inspiring. I'm a physical therapist by background. So being able to work with a company that puts patients first and allows people the ability to walk again is so meaningful. And that's why Watercraft does what it does. And I'm sure you've seen so many patients and you're seeing that transformation. What is it like for you on the other side, giving people the ability to have freedom again? It's incredible. It's stories like Bianca and Tony and all of the other patients in our lives that really, um, that we make an impact on a daily basis. So it's just very meaningful and we love what we do at Watercraft. And your colleague over here, I can't leave him out. <laughs> yeah, um, so I, yeah, I'm one of the, the engineers. Um, one of the engineers. Okay. I don't do. Um, so come, come forward, please. <laughs> Everybody can see you. I don't typically do a lot of PR, but. But that's um, okay. That's but yeah, okay. It's, it's great to be, uh, be on another side of the company and, um, and be able to participate in, in this. And, and working with, uh, not directly as a PT like Sarah, but with patients like Bianca is really a gem. Well, this is, the, this is the connectivity right here. The engineer, what you're putting to paper, what you're actually building, there you go, she could even lean in, is changing people's lives. It's changing her life. What does that mean to you personally? Oh. Yeah. That's we can I think. feel that. We can feel that. Yeah. It's something that maybe I'll never have to experience firsthand, but we get to experience it through, like I said, a patient, great patients we get to work with, like Bianca, and be able to really talk to them face to face and see how their lives have changed. Yeah. Well, we appreciate your honesty. We appreciate your heart because that's what really all of this is about. You know, we have uh, your excellencies here. We have engineers like yourself, PT. We have we have somebody here who uh, who suffered from this through the hands of somebody else. But like all of these things, all of these companies in Google and all these other companies, Amazon and so many others, like these things matter. And this is what we're talking about: the digital future. What does it mean? Not leaving people behind, not leaving people behind like you. So thank you for everything that you're doing, and we really appreciate it, and making the difference here, and for so many others. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Shall we, shall we walk together? Okay. Which way do you want to go? We're going to turn? Okay. We're going to turn together. It's truly incredible. And as an engineer, technology is only going to get better, right? Yeah, of course. So um, like Bianca mentioned, this is a prototype device. And we're actively working on it every day, um, ensuring that we can incorporate more features to be able to give her more of her life back as she can continue to do more and more with it. So, so things are going to become more streamlined. It's going to just become easier, right? Certainly. Okay, wonderful. Well, thank you all again. Please give them a round of applause.